Guys, I told y'all I was gonna bake a cake. I was gonna bake with Kyra. Kyra's telling me later. I don't know what he mean by later, but it ain't gonna be me. Because once I sit down, I sit down. So once I'm done with this and the food is done, I'm gonna bake this cake. I'm gonna get a shower. And after that, I don't wanna be bothered. So we're gonna take out three eggs and then we're gonna take out one cup of water, three fourth cup of oil, and add a little vanilla in that bag. I'm gonna crack my eggs in there. And guys, I'm gonna stir myself away because I'm not the type to use a blender. Um, it's just too much work. So I'm gonna just keep stirring until my hands get tired. I'm spraying that pan and then I'm gonna fill up my muffin pan. It's so delicious. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna put it in the oven and I'm gonna hit you back. Anyways, guys, I also cook food and this is just some pulled pork, some broccoli, and some mashed potatoes. And then if y'all wanna know what Cairo is doing, he is currently in his room doing push ups. Don't mind that toy in the floor. Cairo broke the leg of his toy. Yo! Guys, I haven't been posting because I've been working, but the weekend is here. You already know. I hold y'all name dead in my heart, so what you think I'm going to do? I'm going to be vlogging. Ooh. It's early Friday morning. It's the last day. Let's get through this day because you know I love a good weekend. Ah! Nah, I do love a good weekend though, guys. I'm annoyed because I just already spent $300 since 5 o'clock this morning, and it's not good. But honestly, guys, I had to get it. I'm trying to save money on grooming Tommy, and it's really costing me like a hundred and something to keep grooming him. And he gets hairy very quickly. So now I said, you know what? I'm a barber, so it shouldn't be that hard for me to learn how to groom my dog. And plus, the grooming parlors have too many stipulations, like, um, and then they got so many different pets and animals that they're interacting with, and then. You got him in the cage for so many hours. My work schedule conflict. It's just too much. Too much anxiety around when my dog is going to get groomed. So, this morning I bought a $100 clip of set for him. The one that sucks up the hair at the same time so it won't be messy. And as time progressed, I realized that I don't have to get everything at once because my ADHD brain automatically tells me, like, because I want to groom, let me open up a grooming salon. And it's like, no. So instead, what I've done is started with one piece, and that's just the grooming set with the clippers, uh, the scissors. And so, yeah, I'm gonna start there. And then the next time I get paid, I'll buy the stand, like the grooming stand is a foldable stand that I can unfold and like put up for when I'm grooming him so he can sit up leveled with me and I, I could have a like better experience. And then I'll keep going from there, guys, as I get better. Um, it also come with, like, the nail filer, so I'm going to try to do that as well. But, yeah, your girl did her own hair today, too. I'm just trying to save money, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to ball on a budget. Which I've been up to. I hope y'all been feeling good, feeling great. I hope y'all been doing good, doing great. I haven't been up to much. Um, just working and trying to come up with a master plan so I can clear this debt by tomorrow. That's what I've been doing, trying to clear this debt by the mall. That's it. Um, that's it. So yeah, I'ma holla at y'all though. Like always, give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. Oh guys, what y'all feel about this new TikTok band? For those of you who are in in like into social media, what do y'all feel about this new TikTok band controversy that's going on? Do y'all think they're just gonna change it to a different app? Do y'all think that? It's just not going to be banned and the controversy was just for no reason and just for the hype. What do y'all think? What do y'all think is going on? I felt, for a minute, I felt like they're going to do this whole ban thing because of elections coming up. And the person who wants, um, and, <clears throat> the, and then they're going to use it as a marketing tool. Like, oh, um, I'm trying to, I don't want TikTok and social media to be banned, so vote for me and like stuff like that. That's my personal take on it. I don't speak politics, guys. I don't follow things that are going on in like the political world, but sometimes I feel like drastic changes start around elections and it makes so much sense for marketing. Um, but that's my own opinion. But anyways, um, I hope y'all doing good. I feel myself coming down with a cold already because, of course, I got out the shower, came straight outside, had my jacket wide open because I'm rushing, trying to take out the trash, trying to take out, like, so much things at one time and have my protein shake in my hand. That's another story. Before I hang up, I want to tell y'all about that. Um, my protein shake in my hand and all of, this thing, all of these things going on, guys. And guess what? My jacket was wide open and I felt when the cold got in my chest. Like, I just felt when it went through, seeping through my pores. You ever feel that wrath and you're like, oh snap, hold on. So then I, I, I buckled up. But now <clears throat> I'm gonna cut on that heat so it could like, you know what I'm saying? Change the temperature of my body. 
What do y'all got planned for spring break? Let me know in the comments down below. I know somebody told me about camp for short breaks. Like if it was a summer break, <coughs> um, I would look into camp. Honestly, I'm not that parent unless I totally had to. Like I pray to be in a position where like I'm off most times that my son is off. And so because he has spring break, when I have spring break and because he has summer break when I have summer break, I don't really want to put him in camp except for like the last two weeks because i go back to work two weeks before him um but other than that i don't want to really put him inside of camp because i feel like i pray for moments where i can travel with my kid and like really be out and about with him and spend time with him so i don't want him to be cooped up in the summer camp um i want i want to travel and i want to just spend time this time that i miss out on like i'm being a busy mom throughout the school year i want to make up for that during the summer so that's my plan i don't really want to put him in summer camp i know people are like oh blah, 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 but yeah no um he might join some activities so what i did last summer was like he was playing basketball he had a basketball camp and like i was gonna put him in a swimming camp so like things of that nature i might do but like other than that mm -mm. What are y'all doing with y'all kids for spring break and for the summertime? Let me know in the comments down below. So guys, listen, I'm home alone. My mom is going for the weekend and I was so destroyed at first and I was like, yo, listen, I can't do this. I don't know what to do. I, I, I. But guys, I am definitely, definitely, definitely in here grooving. I turned all the music off because my mom likes to play music all the time, which is not a bad thing because it actually helped me sleep last night. But this morning I said I'm going to turn it off and I'm going to clean up. So I just finished bleaching the floors. What y'all see me doing just now is I don't like when the floor is still like wet. So I'm taking a dry sweater and just going over it to dry it off. So that's what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? Um, what y'all got going on today? This is the weekend. It's raining over here. I normally just be fainting to go outside. But I'm gonna take this out and stay in the house today. Kyra is knocked out sleep right now, guys. Which is why I'm happy I'm up cleaning before he get up and mess up. Isn't that funny? You get up early to clean just for your kid to get up and mess up anyways. Yeah. Guys, do you soak your mop after every use or do you guys um change it? I genuinely have an OCD mop and I be wanting to change it after every freaking use. Um. Also, do you have animals? Because I'm struggling with my, my, my baby boy. Like, he's pissing me off, guys. He, um, I, um, what am I doing? I'm training him, right? He's in training. But like he's, it's like he's, he understands what he's supposed to use the bathroom at, and still just the opposite. Like he uses it when he wants to on his baby pad, and then other times he just confuses me. So what are y'all doing to help potty train? What are y'all doing to help potty train? Let me know down in the comments down below. Like always, guys, I'm gonna hit y'all back. Guys, it's raining, and honestly, I'm chilling, right? I'm laying down. Carol thinks that I'm going to watch him play this game all freaking day. Nah, he's doing a, He's really beating these boys. He's playing um, Spider-Man, guys, and I really didn't think that he would, but he's actually, like, doing the thing. I don't know. What y'all think? Do y'all think I should give him a gaming room? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah? He went to gaming room. And a basketball court. Yeah, oh, he is like stressing me out. I'm gonna have to get a mansion when I get my place because he just got so much stuff. But, um, I love ya. Like, always hit me up. Oh, I did want to ask you do y'all think that this is smart? So, there's a bunch of things that I, I'm the I'm the type of person that, like, when I move, I want to move in with everything. And I feel like when you know that you're working towards something, you just keep gradually working toward it. So, I was thinking about. Like, starting a storage for my moving supplies so that I can encourage myself to, one, hurry up and get on the move of moving, but also so that I don't have to worry about getting, like, um, my place furnished all at one time. So, like, I was just going to buy a little stuff to store, like, um, appliances, like, um, like, furniture, like. Like stuff that I think that I would definitely need so that I won't find myself at one time like, oh, I need to spend 10000 to, to furnish my whole house. What do y'all think about that? Let me know in the comments down below. Like, always give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend that your girl, you know what I'm saying? Your girl is still on her journey to 10K. Give me the 10K. God, like, comment, subscribe. Click that notification bell. I love y'all.